to my expert tutoring, of course. Wowzers! That's the top secret gadget phone. Hello? Darn it. And I was just getting to the chocolate part. Here, Brain, hold this. Gadget here. Sorry, Chief, where are you? I'm in a phone booth outside Penny's school. Take this shortcut. First, a left at 3rd Street. Right, Chief. Go, go, Gadget Mobile. OK, Chief, turning left now. Go, go, Gadget Arm. Sharp right. OK, Chief. Chief must have an important assignment for me. I'm almost there. Chief, why are you yelling at me? Chief, what are you doing up there? Never mind. Here. World's leading seismologist kidnapped. Last seen in Rocky Mountains. Has developed machine to control earthquakes. This message will self-destruct. Don't worry, Chief. I'm always on duty. Uncle Gadget, are you okay? Yes, of course. I'm off to the Rocky Mountains. Oh, please, Uncle Gadget, can I go with you? Hmm. I suppose it's all right. Having to find only one man will be easy for an inspector like me. Thanks, Uncle Gadget. <laughs> Seismologist, I'll hold entire cities for ransom with your earthquake machine. <laughs> I want you to start building now. Y yes, Dr. Claw, R right away. Look, Uncle Gadget, a moose. You should have looked both ways before crossing the road. This must be the warden's cabin. And you must be the warden. That's right. You here to do some fishing? Can you keep a secret? I'm Inspector Gadget. I'm on a top secret assignment to find the world's leading seismologist. He's been kidnapped. Is that so? He's got a trailer up here. I've got to find it. Just a minute. Doll, get some supplies. Special supplies. <laughs> A broken rope, the wrong map, and some dynamite fire logs. <laughs> Everything ready? Yep, all set. Thanks, Warden. I'll be on my way now. Goodbye. Wait till Gadget tries to use the stuff I put in his knapsack, Dr. Claw. <laughs> With Gadget out of the way, there'll be no stopping me. <laughs> I think Uncle Gadget may be in trouble. You better follow him and make sure nothing happens to him. Hello. Hmm, looks like I go down this hill and turn left. Nothing wrong with saving time and energy. Go, go, Gadget roller skates. <laughs> Go, go, Gadget Copter! No, no, no! Aha! The seismologist's trailer. This rope the warden gave me will be perfect. Go, 
go, Gadget Co. This is getting a little ridiculous. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> oh. Must be time for lunch. <laughs> I'll make a little campfire. Ah, rub together vigorously. <laughs> Wowzers! I guess I was rubbing too hard. This can't be the seismologist's place. It's too small. Whoa! Uh, do you know where the seismologist is? Yeah! Oh! Wow! If that isn't the end of Gadget, I'll eat my hat. Oh no, Brain! Was he able to swim to shore? No man could survive such a fall, I'm sorry to say. Oh, Brain, what are we gonna do now? Why don't you fry these fish? Uncle Gadget, you're all right! <laughs> that stream is just filled with trout. But I've got work to do. Yeah, Inspector, I just remembered who could help you. Oh, really? There's an old prospector who lives up in the hills. He knows these parts like the back of his hand. You stay here, Penny. I'll check this out. Brain, you follow Uncle Gadget. The old prospector? Yes, sir. Everyone who's tried to get near his gold has disappeared. Very good. <laughs> Go, go, Gadget Binoculars! Ah, yes, there's my man. Hello! Stay away, you hear? Ooh! Excuse me, I'm Inspector Gadget, and I have a few questions for you. Stay away from my gold! You have a cold? I can't afford to get sick. I'm always on duty. I have to ask you some questions! Maybe my computer book can help locate the seismologist. I'll set the computer to scan this area. Uh-oh! The warden! He's vanished! Where could he... What? Well, maybe I can find out where the tremors are coming from. Hmm. It looks like it's coming from over there. Test the machine again. Use more power. Oh! Well, I'll never get out that way. Hello! Where are you? Ain't no one gonna steal my gold. Now, where could he be? I don't remember seeing those rocks there a minute ago. Could he have gone this way? I sure don't like this place. How do I get out of here? Better load up. No one will suspect this old furnace is really a cannon. <laughs> I worked these hills for 40 years, and no one's gonna steal my fortune. I'll never get tired of looking at you, Goldie. We're just as beautiful as when I found you 10 years ago. Hello, Mr. Prospector! Go away! Leave me alone! I'm sorry you're not feeling well. Don't come any closer! Carnation! I'm looking for the world-famous seismologist. You're not gonna get my gold. I certainly hope not. I can't afford to get sick. I'm always on duty. 
Now, where'd he go? A sauna. That's good for a cold. Hello? I got him! Now to put the old cannon to work. I wonder where he went. <laughs> Take cover! Takes care of him. Now off to work. Oh no! Thanks again, Smokey. Beats me how I got up there. Imagine going to all that trouble so no one will catch his cold. Go, go, gadget legs! No, no, gadget legs! I ask for legs, I get a coat! Go, go, gadget scissors. Now let's see if he's inside. Go, go, gadget neck. No, no, gadget neck. Maybe he's in the sauna again. I feel like Santa Claus. Hello? Anybody home? It's me again. I didn't get a good look at this the first time. Hmm. I guess he's not here after all. Brain, this is Penny. Bring Uncle Gadget right away and follow my homing signal. Something very suspicious is going on here. <laughs> Dr. Claw wants the machine ready in one minute. Has he altered it exactly to my specifications? Yes, sir. <laughs> Everything is just as Dr. Claw wants it. Oh, I hope Brain is picking up the signal. I realize you have work to do, but I just have a couple of questions to ask you. <sighs> Set the machine to Earthquake Hem. You heard Dr. Claw's orders. Start the machine. Yes, right away. Oh, I don't want to hurt him. Hey, where's that light coming from? I knew those tremors came from somewhere. Hello! I said, have you seen the seismologist? Maybe he's deaf. Oh, please keep moving. Hmm, I got inside just in time. Sounds like a bad storm. Wowzers! Oh, my. Gee, that storm sounds very close. Oh. There you are. Just a second. Go, go, gadget legs and arms. No, no, legs and arms. I'm not sure if this is going to work. <laughs> oh, dear. This is terrible. <laughs> that takes care of Gadget. <laughs> Say, have you seen the seismologist? <laughs> ah, so he's that way. Go, go, Gadget Laser! All right, now, where is he? Don't be afraid, sir. Who are you? 
I'll explain later. There's still time to prevent your machine from doing a lot of damage. Tell me how it works. Well, you see that big control panel in the center? If we were able to get up there, we could reduce the pressure. I can do it from here with my computer book. Oh, wonderful. Maybe this way. Hey, wait! wait, 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 wait. One question! <laughs> Go, go, gadget legs! And arms! <laughs> Just a minute! I think I have a little problem here. Now I've got you. Start the machine. my life's work. I've lost my gold. <laughs> hey, wait! Gadget's alive. Get him now. Right, boss. I can't get a fix on this. Try coordinates FR7 and GK4. Of course. Oh, it should only take a minute. Yoo-hoo! Over there. <laughs> there you are! One question! <laughs> We did it, Penny. Now follow me. We must escape. There's Brain and Uncle Gadget. Ooh. We have to get out quick. I'll call the Chief to pick up those two. You better get out fast. What's happening to my machine? <laughs> Are you okay, Uncle Gadget? Uh, uh, yes. Penny, have you seen a... There he goes! Machine. Now, Dr. Claw can't use it to destroy the world. Gadget wins again, but I'll be back. It's done it again. And we got the warden, too. Now, where's Gadget? Yahoo! Go! Hey, wait! Just one question! Wait a minute! Please! When we want to keep fit, what's the first thing we do? We always warm up our muscles before we start exercising. Look at Brain, Uncle Gadget. He's cheating. Uncle Gadget, you're cheating too. That's just to remind you not to take shortcuts when getting in shape. You're only fooling yourself if you do. That's right. And now we'd better run. It sure feels good to run on solid ground. <laughs> oh. 
All right, it's done. My checkbook is perfectly balanced, Penny. Let's go to the bank and take out the money for your new clothes. Thanks, Uncle Gadget. You know, it says here that more and more banks are using microwave transmissions from satellites to do their transactions. Certainly, Penny. Everyone knows that. Our bank was one of the first to use the system. Naturally. I chose it because it used those, uh, uh... Microwave transmissions from satellites, Uncle Gadget. Of course. Now we'd better get over there before they close. The black box has been affixed to the satellite, Dr. Claw. Now everything is ready out in space. I just said that. <laughs> what about it? The black box will allow you to intercept Metro City bank transactions simply by using your console. You can get money anytime you want. Precisely. Now all the money of the Metro City Bank belongs to man. Our agent at the Space Center has placed crazy gas in the repair crew's oxygen tanks. The crazy gas will cause them to hallucinate monsters too hideous to imagine. Crewmen working in space, the gas will make you see monsters. They'll never find the black box. Excellent. Install the other boxes immediately. Yes, yes Dr. Claw. Claw. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Soon I'll have all the banks in my control, and I can have anything I want, Mad Cat. If it's in a bank, it's mine. Now, my first banking transaction. Gadget, your account. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mr. Gadget. There is no money in your account. Let me see that, miss. I don't think you want to do that, Uncle Gadget. <laughs> Where? Aha! Disguised as a bank guard. Very clever disguise. Stand back, Penny. Go, go, Gadget handcuffs. Hey, what do you think you're doing? You're under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be uh, uh... used against you in a court of law. Right. How did you know that? I'm the bank guard. You can't arrest me. A likely story. And a perfect disguise. And strong glue, too. He really is the bank guard, Uncle Gadget. He is? Come on, while I call the police. That won't be necessary. I am the police. And I have a phone right here. Oh, thank you very much. What am I doing? Don't worry, Uncle Gadget. I'll contact Quimby. Something strange is going on here, Brain. There's no money in Uncle Gadget's account, but he keeps all his money here. I don't know where it's gone, Brain. We know where it's gone, don't we, Mad Cat? Now to check on our progress in outer space. <laughs> Huh? I feel funny. I don't know what's wrong. Huh? A space monster! I say. What are you in for? I was making a bank withdrawal. What a coincidence. So was I, and I got two blocks away before they caught me. They got me in the bank. Are you getting hungry?
Hey, don't open that door! You're prisoners! Not bad, now for something to drink. Here you go. Stay in there, please. Please. I say, is someone ringing? Shh. Official police business. Chief, where are you? I'll be right there. There you are, Chief. Here's your assignment, Gadget. And I'll get you out of here right away. Bank funds being stolen. Suspect mad of manipulating microwave satellite transmissions. Investigate immediately. Caution, this message will self-destruct. Right away, Chief. Hey, I just swept that floor. I can't be cleaning up after you all day. Sorry. I know. This is just a bad dream. Gadget's out of jail, Dr. Claw. I'll see that he keeps out of mischief. I know you from somewhere. I never forget a face. I'm a master of disguises, you know. Ouch! Take some deep breaths, mister. What a strange odor. <laughs> Wanna hear a funny story? Huh? This stuff really works. Watch out! What? Oh no! Where the driver went. Wowzers! Go, go, gadget! Copter. Such a beautiful woman. She's so wonderful. Wowzers! Reginald! Gadget's heading into space. I told you to keep him from interfering. Stop him! Yes, sir, Dr. Claw. And now we bring you some strange news from outer space. Satellite repairmen working for Metro City Bank are refusing to work. Now I'm not going out there. There are monsters in outer space. This is the truth. Hmm. Space monsters? Uncle Gadget! They let you go. Of course, Penny. As soon as I check my gadgets, I must head for outer space. I'm on assignment, you know. Go, go, gadget, space helmet. Be it space monster or whatever it is. For Inspector Gadget, it it's just like a little puppy. <gasps> 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 Wowzers! I must have forgotten to fill the oxygen tank. I'll get it refilled at the spaceport. I bet this has something to do with those satellite repairmen. They were scared by something in space and couldn't fix the bank's satellite. You'd better follow Uncle Gadget. What? 
Transmitting communications to Dr. Claw. Calling Dr. Claw. I just said that. Your reports. Next, uh, we will set one on the satellite for international bank transfers. You will be able to get money from any bank in the world. Splendid. Then, we'll install a device to control the stock exchange. After you set them all, I will be able to control everything. recognize you from somewhere? Uh, no, sir. I don't believe so. I never forget a face. I'm a master of disguise, you know. Is the spaceship ready? Oh, uh, yes, sir. It uh, certainly is. Oh! oh, I almost forgot. Fill this with oxygen, please. Now! Oh! <laughs> a little oxygen and a lot of crazy gas. Just like Mama used to be. <laughs> What's the matter, Brain? In Sai Uncle Gadget's helmet? Did you say crazy gas? Who did it? Mad. Those repairmen were probably fed the same gas. Brain, don't take your eyes off Uncle Gadget. What? The Metro City Bank computer is the first thing I should check. Let's see now. Ah, oh, that's better. Uh, Inspector Gadget, it's full. Uh, here you go, sir. Thank you. You'd better stand back. I'm about to take off. In here? I'm an expert pilot. How rude. He didn't even wish me luck on my mission. Since I removed his gyroscope, he'll never be able to leave the hangar. <laughs> Claw, Gadget just took off. Idiot! Well? Yes, sir, Dr. Claw. But the crazy gas is in his oxygen tank. Gadget should not be able to accomplish his mission. Of course. All the computers are working fine. The computer book should be able to help. Oh, oh, bad news. The lunatic inspector is approaching. It's Gadget. I just told him that. Eliminate him so he can't interfere with me. Let's utilize the microwave transmissions to rearrange his molecular structure. Yeah, let's cook him. We'll amplify the satellite's power and demolish the inspector. <laughs> Turn up the heat and fry him. Move the antenna from the Metro City Bank to his spaceship! Power's out! Somebody must have changed the direction of the antenna. Wow! What's the matter, Brain? I'm a rabbit. All right, I'll check uh, it, Brain. Uh, <sighs> it's getting hot in here. Enough toying with him. Let's finish him off. Full power. <laughs> now I have it. The microwaves of the satellite should be controlled by the computer. I should be able to change the direction. A little, A little more. more. I detect a deviation in the directionality of the microwave beams. Yeah! They're coming right at us. Oh, it's hot! Terminate the microwave emissions! I better turn this baby off! Ah. Oh, boy! Report! We got blasted by our own rays! That's it! I can't wait anymore! Change the satellite control system over to me! Uh, right away! You two get gadget! Yes, sir! 
Everything seems to be functioning properly. Wowzers, there's the satellite. Go, go, gadget space helmet. Now to release the dome. Right! We've found Gadget. We won't fail this time. Look at those beautiful stars. I can't believe there are monsters around here. Huh? Look at that. What a beautiful woman. You there, space monster. I, Inspector Gadget, will protect this woman with my light, okay? With this laser. Whoa! Stop, you monster! Right. Oh, darn. The lady is in danger. I'd better help her. It's all right now, my loveliness. Let me kiss your hand, my dear. Ooh. Dear lady, please wait until I defeat him. All the money in the bank is being moved into another account. But whose? Okay. Let's reverse the process. Richer and richer. <laughs> what? Someone's stealing my money. Dr. Claw, we've got Gadget in our tentacles. How would you like him cooked? Forget Gadget. Fix the satellite. It's giving away my money. Oh, uh, we'll give it our fullest attention. You got it, Doc. <laughs> Go away! She's mine! All mine! Go away from here! Ah! Mine! She's all mine! Go, go, gadget flower! It's the police! They'll catch us! Let's get out of here! I did. Next time, yeah. I'll close your account forever, Gadget! Do you smell gas, Uncle Gadget? That burner didn't go on. Wait, Uncle Gadget. When you smell gas, that's a warning that there's a gas leak. Turn off all gas, and air out the room before lighting the flame. If you hadn't done that, there might have been an explosion. And if you can't find where it's coming from, call your gas company. Penny, can I make my tea now? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> And here, ladies and gentlemen, is our most famous exhibit, the oldest Mayan artifact known to exist, the Emerald Duck. Legend says the duck is the key to untold powers. It was first discovered in... It is I, Macho Miguel. <gasps> Hear me, I said. Arriba! Thus, 
some more than I keep. Thank you for helping me with my duck project for school, Uncle Gadget. I'm an old hand at ducks, Penny. Watch me use this duck collar to lure them closer so you can take a picture. <coughs> that ought to attract our little feathered friends. Aha! There's one now. That's the second biggest duck I've ever seen. That's a moose, Uncle Gadget. And he's charging right at us. Go, go, Gadget, sail. I'm taking this duck collar back to the store. It doesn't work. Wowzers, the top secret gadget phone. Is that you, Chief? Right, Chief. I'll be right there. Go, go, gadget fan! Quack, quack! Over here, gadget. Here's your assignment. The fabled emerald duck has been stolen by mad agent Macho Miguel. He must be stopped before Dr. Claw uses secret powers of duck. This message will self-destruct. Don't worry, Chief. I'm always on duty. No! And it's not even duck season. Dr. Claw calling Macho Miguel. Come in, Agent Miguel. Where is that idiot? Ah, Macho Miguel is here. Enough, you fool. Do you have the duck? Yes, sir. Excellent. My key to untold powers. These ancient writings say you must look through the eye of the sun god to see where the emerald duck roosts. When the duck is in place, the ancient crystal weapon of the sun god will be revealed. But first, there's someone I have to take care of. <laughs> Gee, I'm so sure glad my teacher gave me permission to go with you, Uncle Gadget. Yes, Penny. You and Brain can have a nice vacation while I complete my mission. Welcome aboard, Inspector Gadget. Enjoy your flight. They're on the plane, boss. Excellent. I hope Gadget enjoys his final flight. <laughs> Gosh, Uncle Gadget, I haven't seen the stewardess since we took off. Yes, Penny. I'll go check the pilot's cabin. Golly, Brain, I wonder why there are no other passengers. Say, fellas, have you seen the stewardess? Bon voyage, Gadget. <laughs> why? What's happening? Say, fellas, this plane seems to be flying crazy. Happy landing. <laughs> A lot of help you two dummies are. Someone is guiding the plane by remote control. I've got to jam the signals and gain control with my computer book. I've got it! I've lost control. Time to lose, Penny. Follow me. Go, go, Gadget, go! All aboard! Wow, that was a close one, Uncle Gadget. Yes, Penny. Lucky for us, I was able to land the plane. Curse your luck, Gadget. Oh, Major Miguel, Gadget has slipped through my trap. You must eliminate him. It will be my pleasure, Dr. Claw. I'll take him to the jungle, and he'll never return. And now, I make my macho exit. Forget the theatrics, you fool. Just get Gadget. Yes, Dr. Claw. You two check into this hotel while I track down the Emerald Duck. Be careful and stay out of trouble. I'm going to look for clues. You're right, Brain. We'd better follow him. So, the scene of the crime. 
I ought to be able to find a few clues around here. Hmm. Buenos dias, I... Inspector. Looking for something? Go, go, Gadget Legs! I'm looking for an emerald duck. It was stolen by a mad agent named Macho Miguel. Ah, yes, he's a very famous and clever bandito. Would you like me to lead you to his hideout? Wowzers, do you know where Macho Miguel is hiding? Follow me, Inspector. This must be my lucky day. Wrong, Gadget. This is my lucky day. <laughs> <laughs> So where is this mad agent's hideout? A fearless bandito like him lives deep in the jungle so no one can find him. <laughs> yes, Brain. I'm afraid Uncle Gadget may be in danger. Chief Quimby's message said the Emerald Duck has secret powers. I'm going to see what I can find out about it. You'd better follow Uncle Gadget. I'll come as soon as I can. <laughs> Are you sure this is the way to Macho Miguel's hideout? Trust me, he's closer than you think. Oh my gosh! This book says the Emerald Duck is the key to an ancient crystal-powered weapon. Legend says it is the most destructive weapon known to man. So that's what Dr. Claw's after. I've got to warn Uncle Gadget. Is it much farther? Don't worry. Your journey will soon be over, Inspector. Love. Wowzers! What a view! Enjoy the view, Inspector. It certainly is a long way down. Yes, isn't it? <laughs> wow. Adios, Inspector! Wowzers! Go, go, Gadget Copter! <laughs> I guess they don't make mountain ledges like they used to. Santa Maria! Come in, Brain. Where are you? Wow. Dr. Claw's going to try and steal an ancient weapon. We've got to stop him from using the Emerald Duck. Keep an eye on Uncle Gadget, Brain. He could be in danger. After you, Inspector. Thanks, friend. Whoa! Wowzers, this sand sure is soft. Hmm. I guess my friend has gone for help. Gadget is finished, Dr. Claw. Excellent. <laughs> Wowzers! I hope my friend comes back soon. I'd better check on Brain. <gasps> go, go, Gadget Nick! Go, go, Gadget Coot! Go, go, Gadget Nick! <sighs> That's much better. Aha! A fun! I'll use that to get out. I'd better find my friend. Gosh, you scared me. It's true you seek the Emerald Duck. Beware, it has dangerous powers. Yes, sir, I know. It's been stolen, and I've got to help get it back before Dr. Claw uses it to steal the ancient weapon. Then you must hurry. Come with me. Gadget has been taken care of, Dr. Claw. And now I shall find the ancient weapon. And I will be there to claim it. Boys! Arriba! Oh. So there you are. I was afraid I'd lost you. This path leads to a trail cut through the mountains by the Ancient Ones. The trail leads to the Great Waterfall. Whoever has the Emerald Duck must go there if he seeks the crystal weapon. I'd better hurry. Thanks for your help. Oh, I'm afraid the way is too difficult for my old legs. Oh, don't worry. I'll be all right. I hope. Here you are, Inspector. 
This is Macho Miguel's hideout? Yes, let's see if he's home. After you, Inspector. Hmm. He must be afraid of the dark. I wonder what this place was used for. Wowzers! I guess it used to be a bowling alley. Go, go, Gadget Lakes! through the eye of the sun god now. I can see the great waterfall. That must be where to find the emerald duck's roost. Good work. You will be rewarded. <laughs> it won't be much longer, Mad Cat, until the crystal weapon is mine. And now, my exit! Excuse me, friend, but I don't think anybody is home. Hi! I'm sure the bad hombre is in here, Inspector. This is a secret room. All right, you're under arrest. There's nobody in here. Wowzers, look at all this sand. Somebody isn't a very good housekeeper. <laughs> should look somewhere else for this macho fellow. Wow. This old bridge isn't in very good shape. Uh-oh. Time for lunch, Inspector. We really have no time for lunch. I never eat while I'm on duty. Not your lunch. The Piranha's lunch. Very kind of you. But we have no piranha food with us. Oh, yes, we do. Right. Oh, I see. You want to go for a swim. Well, no thanks. You see, I'd really rather not get my coat wet. Go, go, Gadget Lakes! Uh-oh. Now, where'd that fellow go? He isn't upset because I didn't want to go swimming. Binoculars. Aha! There he is. He's going mountain climbing. I'd better see if he needs help. Go, go, gadget copter. These steps must lead down behind the waterfall. Oh my gosh, an ancient statue hidden by the falls. And that must... 
must be the crystal weapon. I'd better call for help. I have an urgent message for Chief Quimby from Inspector Gadget. <laughs> saw you mountain climbing. Uh, I came to see if you needed any help. Yes, you can help. Here, hold this. was a bad toss. The crystal is being activated by the sunlight. Congratulations, Gadget. Once again, you foiled Dr. Claw's evil plan. It was nothing, Chief. Things just kind of fell into place. Just wait, Gadget. I'll be back. I'll get you. can't see any at all. See any what, Uncle Gadget? Mayans, Penny. Oh, Uncle Gadget, there haven't been any mines around for hundreds of years. Hmm, I wonder. Whoa! Ouch! Well, now you know why there are no Mayans around anymore. Some Mayan left this rock on the stairs, and it caused an accident. Never leave anything sitting on the stairs. It could cause a nasty fall even hundreds of years later. Ow! <laughs> According to this sign, Uncle Gadget, this is Congo, largest gorilla in captivity. He likes bananas, cantaloupes, and papayas. He doesn't like... Interesting animal. Watch me get his attention. But Uncle Gadget, he doesn't like, huh? Uncle Gadget, look out! Wowzers! What's got into him? I was trying to tell you, Uncle Gadget. He doesn't like people imitating him. Now you tell me. Wow, what a ride. My ears are ringing. Uncle, that's your top secret gadget phone. Is that you, Chief? You're where? I'm right here. Oh, hi, Chief. Here's your assignment, Gadget. Two oldest tribes in the Balkan Mountains are waging battle, endangering the entire area. Suspect mad plot. Investigate. This message will self-destruct. I'm always on duty, Chief. On my way. Uh-oh. Gadget! Wait a minute. This assignment will give me a chance to test my newest gadget. Go, go, Gadget Rocket States. I think they need a little more work. Wait! Come back here! I better check where Uncle Gadget is going. 
Those tribes must be the Hooplas and the Duplas, the longest living tribes on Earth. We'd better follow Uncle Gadget. Soon, I'll have the ancient mountain goat and its special yogurt. Then, every man agent will be as strong as an army and stay youthful forever. And mad will rule the world! <laughs> Excuse me, this is where I get off. I'm sorry, sir, but the airport is miles away. If you can keep a secret, I am Inspector Gadget on an urgent case. Sorry, sir. First door on your left. Thank you. Go, go, Gadget Brella! After him, Brain. I'll meet you down below. Whoa! Wowzers! Go, go, get it, coat! Any further, the two tribes of Hoopla and Dupla are fighting over there. Thank you for the lift. Goodbye. Ah, it's a beautiful day for a stroll up a friendly Balkan road. And there's a mountain lady and her donkey. Oh, that's very quaint. Beating time, Nakita. Kick the cut and I will double your lunch. Excuse me, madam. Could you tell me how to get to the villages of Hoopla and Dupla? Right this way, sir. Step past the turnstile. Thank you. I'll be on my way. It's right. Just go straight through. And to your doom, Gadget. Step right through the turnstile. <laughs> roar, roar! <laughs> Serves him right, pushing in front of me like that. Go, go, Gadget Legs! I never did like revolving doors. Stop! You can't do that! Idiot! Make sure he never reaches the villagers of Hoopla and Dupla. Let's see now. That's Hoopla on the right and Dupla on the left. Or is it the other way around? Go, go, Gadget Binoculars! Hmm, some kind of ancient mountain games taking place. Maybe I could join them. Want a lift, young man? Why, thank you. I wouldn't mind at all. Jump in the back. What a sweet old lady. Brain, I'm going on to the village of Dupla. You keep an eye on Uncle Gadget. Oh, wow. Well. There's the village. How did he do that? This calls for some investigating. What a view! I'll give you a... <laughs> I'll give you a better view! This! Wowzers! Yikes!
Magic yogurt. Fire three. Open the gates. It is I, Yuri Senior, and the God. He dropped something. Hmm. Some kind of goat's milk yogurt. Whoa! This is strong stuff. Ah! Huh? So that's it. I've got to find that goat. But how will I get in there? Margyar! A spy from Dupla is approaching. What? We'll give him a warm welcome. Heat up the bread oven. <laughs> Stop, rocket skate. Stop! Good day, ladies. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Let me introduce myself. <laughs> My name is Inspector Gadget, and I'm... Whoa! What a warm welcome. Go, go, Gadget Waterfinger. A steam bath. Just the thing after a long hike. What does he do it? We'll have to use more drastic measures. Toss him in the pit. Did anybody order double cheese? <laughs> Tough crowd. What are we doing now? It's lunchtime. Really? I could use a bite right now. Then a bite you're going to get, Gadget, in the bear pit. <laughs> Have you got the goat yet? With Gadget out of the way, it will soon be yours, Dr. Claw. Excellent. Do not fail me. That goat's yogurt will give me eternal youth. Sounds like I'm not the only one that's hungry. <gasps> Draw him in! Go, go, Gadget, spring! Uh, excuse me. Wowzers! I don't think this furry fellow wants to make friends. Go, go, gadget copter! Go Gadget Legs! Thank you, ladies, for your hospitality. But I really must get back to my investigation. Let's get rid of this troublemaker once and for all. Some welcome. Hi, fellas. Master Yuri, that man is a spy from Hoopla. What? 
We know how to take care of spies in Dupla. While they're taking care of Gadget, I'll steal the gold. Rain, you made it. You keep an eye on Uncle Gadget. I'd better find that goat before Dr. Claw's agents do. He is here to steal the mystical goat. <laughs> really, fellas, I must get back to work. We'll give him the ancient mountain welcome. Tie him to the stake. Just as I thought. This goat's yogurt has some strange culture that gives these people incredible strength and eternal youth. Okay, goat, you're coming with me. <gasps> Someone's coming. So there you are. We shouldn't keep Dr. Claw waiting now, should we? That's a mad agent dressed like one of the old men of the village. Hmm, everything seems quiet. We have a right to that goat, too. It's time to attack. Another game, fellas? This is some festival you're having. Charge! The old women are coming! Oh, good, a party! We'll send them our happy guest. <laughs> with the goat. I've got to stop him before he reaches Dr. Claw. The goat is on its way, Dr. Claw. <laughs> Excellent. I'll meet you on the mountain top. <laughs> this will take care of him. Watch. I've sprung a leak. Yikes! Charge! Those women seem to be in a terrible hurry. Wowzers! Go, go, catch it on! It must be lunchtime. All right, you old goat. Where's the goat? Ah, oh, pipe down, you old hag. Papa, Papa! Huh? Look! That man took our goat! Now look what you've done! Never mind that. Let's just get him. But first, we're all going to need a mouthful of our energy-giving yogurt. Line up! Oh, I feel 50 years young. Yeah. I could flatten the mountain! <laughs> Yahoo! Come on, you stubborn goat! Wowzers! I'd rather help that man. Go, go, Gadget Copter! Hold on! First I'll get you to safety, then I'll take care of your goat! I'd better call Chief Quimby. Calling Chief Quimby for Inspector Gadget. Come here, goat. Nice goat. Come to Inspector Gadget. Go, go, gadget hand. Go, go, gadget arms. Wowzers, they've all got phony beards. Go, go, gadget coat. That goat, I want him. He's mine! I'm trying, Dr. Claw. I'm trying! Aha! The goat is mine! The goat is ours! Nice little billy goat. 
Time to go back to your little billy goat place. So you tried to get our goat? You betrayed us! All this, and I don't even like goat's milk. There you go. All safe and sound. <laughs> Funny how it always takes an outside threat to get folks to be cooperating. Yes, true. <laughs> Thanks, Sonny. We really appreciate all you've done. And here's your reward. For a young whelp like you, that should last a week. Kids today, they're all so greedy. Anyway, time for a celebration. Hit it, boys! We can head home now, Brain. Brain? <laughs> Mountain Resort, where the world's athletes are gathered for the opening of the Olympic Games. <laughs> and the perfect opportunity to show the world the supremacy of mad. A mad cat. <laughs> and what brings you to Winterland, young lady? I'm here with my uncle. Oh, look! There he is! Inspector Gadget, the world's most famous detective. <coughs> I'm off duty. Uncle, are you sure Chief Quimby doesn't know where you are? Of course, Penny. I'm taking one week's vacation, and I'm absolutely, completely, and totally off duty. <coughs> Holy mountain goat! That's the top secret gadget phone. Is that you, Chief? You're where? Sorry to interrupt your vacation, Gadget, but, uh... Take all precautions. Dr. Clore and Winterland, this message will self-destruct. Don't worry, Chief. I'm always on duty. <laughs> With my cold weather warning system, Dr. Claw won't dare to show his face. <laughs> That's what he thinks. <laughs> he hasn't seen my mad yodeler. <laughs> Here you fool at Gadget's chalet. Avalanche him. 
Get gadget. Yes, sir. Oh, yes, sir. Indeed, sir. Get the bottle. Do I see what I think I see? Wowzers. That innocent yodeler is heading straight for my trap. I've got to stop him. That doesn't look like an innocent yodeler to me. No way. Stop! Stop, my good man! Watch him, Brain. Just one step further, my good man, and you have fallen into my secret gadget trap. <laughs> good thing we braced ourselves. Excuse me. Let me brush you off. I'm so sorry. Ah, your sheet music. Here, let me help you. Mm, la la. Catchy little tune. La la. <laughs> Sorry about that. Dum de dum dum. Ah. <laughs> I'm such a butterfingers. La la. Wow, what's going on here? Whoa. Brain, come in, Brain. This is Penny. Do you read me, Brain? <laughs> That's the Mad Yodler, one of Doctor Claw's <laughs> secret agents. <laughs> <laughs> Do, re, mi, la, si, do, re, mi, la, si. Thank you. Do. Oh, My goodness, I'm so sorry. Let me dust you off again. No way! <laughs> Strange people, these mountain folks. And with the lighting of the Olympic flame, this year's Winter Olympic Games will now begin. Look, Uncle, there's the Olympic torch bearer. Indeed it is, Penny. <laughs> yes, it's lovely. Oh, I wonder if... Chief Quimby, you're no bear. That's no torchbearer. Wowzer, that's one of Dr. Claw's men. Torchbearer carrying dynamite. Must stop. This message will self-destruct. Don't worry, Chief. I'll get him. <coughs> Chief Wimby, are you all right? <laughs> Why do I put up with him? You there, stop in the name of the law! What's this? An unidentified skier is on the run. Stop! Stop! Stay calm, Brain. With my gadget snow sail, we'll freeze right up the slope. <laughs> One thing about sailing, Brain, always check the wind first. And now to inflate my gadget float. Hey? Let this be a lesson to you next time you try and bust somebody's balloon, Buster. There's the thief! No, no, you've got the wrong man! I've got to get rid of this dynamite! Wayne, are you there? Oh, wow. Follow them, Brain. We've got to help Uncle Gadget. I've got to get rid of this dynamite before it explodes. <laughs> oh, that's it. Oh. Wow, 
Wowzers! This is dangerous. Go on, beat it. Will you get out of here? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah! Oh, wow, woof, woof, woof. This guy's getting on my gadget nerves. <laughs> Traveling in disguise is a garbage pail, eh? Time for my gadget snow gun. <laughs> Scratch one mad agent disguised as a garbage pail. Catch mad agents. Gadget on bugs that course eliminate him. Gotcha, boss. Nothing like a little oil to grease things up. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, watch it! Come back here, you! Burk, burk! Oil well, it ends well! Stop! Out of that bobsled, you! Wait! Inspector Gadget! Who else? Wow, wow, rough. Yes, it's us. Precisely. And as you see, we've just saved the Olympic Village from this fake torch loaded with dynamite. <laughs> oh, boy. What a neat idea, Uncle Gadget. Private ski lessons. Only the best for Inspector Gadget. Ski lessons, eh? I've got just the idea to eliminate Gadget once and for all. Plan XB7A. I knew we were nearby. This is the spookiest ski school I've ever seen. Oh, but it's beautiful, Penny. Look at all its medieval charm. Welcome to Winterland Ski School, the world's first automated ski resort. Hmm. That voice sounds awfully familiar. The place is weird. This must be the automated gondola. Ah, the wonders of the modern age. Ooh. Come along, Brain. Pets are allowed. The Winterland Gondola traverses 19,000 feet with the highest vertical drop in the world. Uncle, are you sure this thing is safe? Why, as safe as the ground I'm standing on. Go, go, get it on! <gasps> and now what do you say, Uncle? I'm calling the maintenance department. This gondola hasn't been serviced in months. At the top of the lift, your first automated ski lesson will begin. Not only their first, but their last. I've never heard of an automated ski lesson. As long as your feet are on the ground, Penny, nothing can go wrong. Yeah. The T-Bar's picking up speed. Not at all, Penny. Just relax and enjoy the scenery. Flight down with my gadget umbrella. Go, go, gadget umbrella. Mm. Go, go, gadget umbrella. Mm. Gadget umbrella, go! Gadget, go, umbrella, umbrella, gadget, gadget! Ah! 
Like I said, Penny, as long as your feet are on the ground, nothing can go wrong. The problem is keeping your feet on the ground. The beautiful thing about a modern resort, Penny, is it's totally unspoiled by crowds. Hmm, but Uncle Gadget, there's not even an instructor here. Don't worry, Penny. As a former champion skater myself, I'll show you how the pros do it. No, Rain, not like that. Bend your knees more, like this. Uncle, look! Wowzer! Our ice rink has become an iceberg. We're hitting straight for that waterfall. Stay calm, Penny. With my gadget arm, you're free from harm. Go, go, gadget arms. Boom. Uncle? No problem. Go, go, gadget brain. <laughs> Come on. Get it, brain. Get it together, Uncle. I'm trying, I'm trying. Oh, Uncle Gadget, are you okay? <laughs> Yeah, I know. <laughs> Uncle, what are you doing there? Stay calm, Penny. I'm on a secret mission. Chief, are you there? Another self-destructing message. Mad will use strange animal to disrupt games. Don't worry, Chief. No need to fear when Gadget is here. Now, Mad Cat, Mad's ultimate weapon, the abominable Snowbat. <laughs> the perfect vantage point. From here, I can survey all of Winterland. I've got a strange suspicion I'm being followed. Hmm, very strange. Very strange indeed. Go, go, Gadget Captain! Get me here, Brain. Oh. Follow him! Oh, woof! Woof! Woody, the part breaker! Phony feathers. I wonder if that could be the animal. Police, show me your face. You'll do your explaining behind bars. Don't try to run. I've got you surrounded. You're under arrest. I said you're under arrest. Would you mind answering a couple of questions? <laughs> Thought you got rid of me, eh? <laughs> There's no escape from Inspector Gadget. Give up. All right, buddy, that's it. You're under arrest. Now for the ski jump competition. Next jumper, please. Ready, set. What a jump! It's a new world record! Here on the hockey rink, time is running out for green team. But wait, look! Incredible! Stay calm, everyone. Inspector Gadget has everything well in hand. <laughs> Good work, Snowbat. Now bring him to the castle. 
Surrender now, monster. It's your last chance. Brain! Brain! Take laser homing device and follow Uncle Gadget. Right. Now I'll tune in my computer on this electronic creep's frequency. Brain, my loyal friend, what are you doing? Free boss! Brain, you're freeing the suspect! Now I've got its frequency. Stop, please. Destroying private property is a federal offense. Now, monster, self-destruct! Look over there, Brain. It's Dr. Claw's secret shuttle. Wowzers! What have you done with my dog? Hey, come back here! Bring my dog back here! Hey, you monster! You dumb monster! Gold medal for best demonstrating the Olympic spirit. <laughs> Inspector Gadget. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> I'm flattered. Remember, kids, snow sports provide us with good exercise and fun. But like any sport, you should be careful so you don't get hurt. Observe the rules. Remember, never ski by yourself. And always remember the principles of sportsmanship. <laughs> And last but not least, never bring your dog to the ski slopes. Dr. Claw, I think you'll be happy with my latest piece of work. My devoted assistant will show you. Monotone, the chart! Uh, yes, uh, yes. Uh, this is Gadget's family tree. Uh, it's a beautiful tree. Uh, very rare. Uh, very rare. It's disgusting! <laughs> But, Dr. Claw, this is a new way to eliminate Gadget. Oh, uh, yes, yes, yes. Monotone, the chart! Oh, uh, yes, 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 yes. This is Gadget's family tree. Beautiful tree. Um, very rare. If we could eliminate Gadget's ancestors, Gadget will never come to be. We will control the future by changing the past. But your question will be how to travel into the past. Let me demonstrate. I <laughs> know. Oh, no. I have created a time machine. Very beautiful. Very rare. I will now take a little walk. Wonderful. I'm back. And? This is Henry VIII's wedding ring. I could have anything. Gadget, an army of warriors from the past. Dinosaurs. Dinosaurs? An army of dinosaurs. First, I'll crush the first gadget. Then I'll crush Metro City. Do it now. Yes, sir. It's all right, Brain. Mammoths have been dead for millions of years. Penny, Brain, I can make this airplane fly with my gadget power. Hey, get back here with that. Oh! Oh! Wow! The top secret gadget ball. Stop! Uncle Gadget! Ah! You're aware? Right away, Chief. You ought to get some carpeting for these hard floors. No, Brain! I'll stay with the guard, Brain. You follow Uncle Gadget and find out what's going on. Chief, where are you? In here, Gadget. Here's your assignment. Man has gone back in time. Suspect agents bringing back dinosaurs to rule Metro City. See Professor Von Slickstein at Police Lab. Caution, this message will self-destruct. Whoa! Right away, Chief. Inspector Gadget is always on duty. Gadget! We've landed in the middle.
Mesozoic era. Now, all we have to do is get the Brontosauri out of the swamp. Fortunately, we brought lots of carrots along. Get on with it. But first, eliminate Gadget's ancestor. <laughs> I have reproduced the H.G. Wells time machine, as you can see. A time machine? It doesn't even have a clock. You mean we can go back in time and see real dinosaurs? Absolutely. With greatest of ease, we could travel back in time. Wowzers! Traveling in time. Let's go. I'm always on duty, and when duty calls, I answer. This is the restore button. When you push it, everything within one block of the machine is restored to its normal time period. Dinosaurs are waiting for us, Penny. Let's go. Great! We're going, too. Come on, Brain. This will be a great educational experience. Well, uh, well, well. Come on, Brain. You'll be safe with me. Well, well. I'll miss you if you don't come. Now, this is the lever that moves the machine back and forth in time. Not yet! It hasn't been calibrated! Dinosaurs, here we come. should have made a left turn. But let's find the dinosaurs first. Let's ask these nice gentlemen. Hello there. I don't like this brain. Hello, gentlemen. Inspector Gadget's the name. We're looking for some dinosaurs. Have you seen any suspicious characters around? <laughs> Go, go, Gadget Binoculars! Tananga Kachunga! Huh? She, 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 she! Oh, Uncle Gadget, you have to save him! No problem, Penny. It's just a big kitty cat. Go, go, Gadget Copter! <laughs> shoo! Shee, shee, shoo! Kitties hate water. Go, go, Gadget Squirt Gun! A sleeping gas. I've got to get these fingers checked. I can't believe it, Uncle Gadget. This caveman looks just like you. Maybe he's your first ancestor. Erga, come on. Now, now, the pleasure is all mine, Great Grandfather Gadget. Pleased to meet you, little girl. I think you're a god. Nonsense, Penny. I'm a police inspector. <laughs> Uncle, I don't think we have anything to worry about. We're coming, Thelma! Can't you do it a little more quietly? Wait, wait, wait a minute! Where to, Selma? The Cenozoic era, beginning of human life. I have some business to attend to. <laughs> this looks like the right place. We're going to eliminate Gadget's first ancestor. <laughs> Penny, I think I'll take a walk with my great-grandfather Gadget. You better follow them, Brain. Oh, 
Oh no! Gadget himself! Dr. Claw! Gadget! Gadget is here! Eliminate him! Eliminate his ancestor! Huh? What is that? Go! Go! Crush Gadget! Wow! That's a dinosaur! Here I am! Here I am! Oh, wow! Dinosaurs go. Mud baths are excellent for your health, but I am a duty. Gadgets are still alive! Crush them! Make sure you succeed this time, or I'll leave you here! Brain! There are mad agents here. They're trying to get Uncle Gadget and Great Grandfather Gadget. They brought dinosaurs along. <laughs> You've got to protect them. I'll find the mad time machine. Wowzers! This looks good. Someone has to taste it to make sure it's safe. Ah! This is delicious! Oh, um, um. Wowzers! Oh, gosh! A hairy elephant. Oh, here you go. See, this is what you do. Just a bunch of hairy elephants. Let's get them.
Claw, what an unexpected pleasure. Uh, we're having a little uh, problem here. Our time machine was smashed and Gadget's still alive. What? Uh, but it really wasn't our fault. You see, some woolly mammoths. Enough! Eliminate Gadget and bring me those dinosaurs, or... Or... Don't show your face in the 20th century! Uncle Gadget! We're in trouble! Hi, Penny. This is my new friend. Hello. Thank you. <laughs> Uncle Gadget! Dinosaurs in... Dinosaurs? Wowzers! Quick, Uncle Gadget! Wooga Wong! Oh no! How will we get back to the 20th century? We'd better call the Auto Club. What's wrong, Brain? Whoa! There's a dinosaur here! Wowzers! <laughs> here, boy. Nice doggy. Uncle Gadget, he might hurt you. Here, take this. Nonsense, Penny. It's a friendly dog. Whoa! This dog is too friendly. Hang on, Uncle Gadget. Raver! Look at that! Good. Now's our chance. Hi. Let's all be friends. Oh, Uncle Gadget, be careful. Machine. Okay, we all have to cooperate. <laughs> Brain, you protect Uncle Gadget and Great Grandfather Gadget. Right. Baby Mammoth, you help fix the time machine. Cave Penny, you go and pick some fruit. Now remember, they're all very important jobs. <laughs> Careful now. Now we have everything we need. Let's find Uncle Gadget. Wow. Look at that. Hi, Brain. Here we are. Hey, Penny. We've really become good friends. How nice, Uncle Gadget. It's time to go home now. I always wanted to do this. Yo! Yo! Take you with me. Ah, oh, what a splendid present. And here's a present from me. I'm ready, Uncle Gadget. Wowzers. We sure got some wonderful gifts. Okay, let's go. Go, go, time machine. Huh? Please take us back. Uncle Gadget? Okay, Penny. Go, go, machine hands.
Congress. Congratulations, Gadget. You returned the dinosaurs to the Mesozoic era. I don't know how you do it. You know me, Chief. I always try to help an animal in need. I'll get you, Gadget. I'll follow you through time. I'll wipe out your ancestors. You'll never exist! Uncle Gadget, it's wonderful the way you get along with animals. Yes, Penny. Animals are our friends, and they need us to provide certain things. Our pets need us to provide fresh water and food. Wild animals usually find their own. But that big doggy needed to be shown where the food was. Right, Uncle Gadget. Sometimes carrying around a snack isn't a bad idea. <laughs>